going through them, I can tell you a few things about them. This one's from the Jelly Baby series. Um, and that was a, a whole series of aeroplane jelly paintings. Um, this was during COVID and I started looking at the numbers of um, COVID cases. Um, this little guy here um, is another James Cook Drive painting. Um, and there is a, I think there's a goat there and there's some more curlews. But this is quite an old, an old um, James Cook Drive painting. Another aeroplane jelly painting here, made into a bag, different sections. Um, this little guy is um, ant hills. So that was the road to, and this would be the trees, sections of the trees. And this was a woodblock print that I printed onto the canvas. Um, and once again, if I turn it that way, we can see the woodblock, oh, sorry, the, yeah, well, the woodblock, but also the ant hills. Um, in amongst the, the trees there. Um, this one here is my grandmother left me her sewing table and I did a whole series on my grandmother's sewing table. So this is the, um, what are they called? Not bobbins, um, spool, uh, yeah, cotton reels, cotton reels. Um, so that's quite a simple little one just with a little bit of colour there. But on the back we've got scissors and the box and different bits and pieces that came out of the actual um, uh, drawers. I still have the drawers, they still have everything in them that was uh, that she left in there. And this little one here, um, this one here was from my life drawing class and you can just see one figure here and um, on the back there's a blue figure standing there drawing at an easel. Um, there's the different design. I am going to start doing some different designs as well, but this is a, a, another design which is um, a, a smaller bag and it has a beautiful, I really enjoy that bit of um, printed spotty bias which um, goes around the edge here. I do have a seamstress make them because um, that's so time consuming I don't have the actual time to do it myself um, and I struggle with sewing so um, this is the last one I'll show you which is um, part of an old menu board um, it's the rough side of the menu board you can't really see any letters there but um, it's yeah so it's it's um, probably from 2004, that one there. Um, and probably that's all about all I can say about that. There are different, I use different um, webbing or hand sewn straps, depending on what I feel is going to work with the particular design on the bag.